Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, Deuteronomy, Joshua, Judges, Ruth, First and Second Samuel, First and Second Kings, First and Second Chronicles, oh, Ezra, Nehemiah, Esther, Job, Psalms and Proverbs, Ecclesiastes, Song of Solomon, Isaiah, Jeremiah, Lamentations, Oh, Ezekiel, Daniel, Hosea, Joel, Amos, Obadiah, Jonah, Micah, Nahum, Habakkuk, Zephaniah, Haggai, Zechariah, Malachi. Hello, and welcome to Faith and Storytime from St. Andrew Lutheran Church in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, a member congregation of the Evangelical Lutheran Church in America. I'm Chris, and this week we have a special guest, Mr. Phil, and Miss Amy will be joining us for music. I'm so glad you could be here as we continue our journey through the Old Testament, the Hebrew Scriptures. Today we hear about Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego in the fiery furnace. Hello, boys and girls of St. Andrew Lutheran Church. My name is Phil, and I'm the dad of little Julian, medium Giovanni, and big Ben. And I'm here to read you a story today about Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, and a fiery furnace. Wow, those are some crazy names. Let's say them together. Ready? Shadrach, Meshach, Abednego. Good. Good. Let's read the story now. The fiery furnace. It's a little scary, but you'll be okay. King Nebuchadnezzar was so angry that his face scrunched up and almost turned purple. Why was he so mad? He, uh, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego three of his workers had said no when King Nebuchadnezzar declared that everyone had to bow down to uh, this huge golden statue he had made for himself. It's a big golden statue. Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego knew that God was the only one they should worship, but this made King Nebuchadnezzar so angry, no one disobeyed the king. The king demanded to have the men tied up and thrown into a furnace. He even ordered to have the furnace turned up seven times hotter than normal. Ouch! It was hot! When King Nebuchadnezzar peeked into the furnace to see Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, he was surprised. I wonder why he was surprised. Let's turn the page and find out. I thought I threw three men in there, he shouted. But I see four men walking around in there, and they aren't even tied up. They're fine. Who, what's going on in there? The extra man in the furnace was an angel sent by God to protect Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego from the fire. The king flung open the door uh, of the hot, fiery furnace and called, Shadrach, Meshach, Abednego, come out right now. When they came out, everyone noticed that the fire hadn't even hurt them. They didn't even smell like smoke. King Nebuchadnezzar was amazed and realized what had happened. Your God sent an angel to protect you. 
you, you disobeyed me from uh, and faced death rather than uh, rather than worship someone other than your own god i declare that no one in any country should say anything against the god of shadrach meshach and abednego because no god can do what their god can do i hope you've enjoyed our story of shadrach meshach and abednego in the power of the one god we worship amen today we heard the story of shadrach meshach and abednego and they refused to bow down to the king because they knew they should only worship our god so they got thrown into the fiery furnace but you know what they were not afraid they knew that god would take care of them they trusted in our god so our song today is i will trust the lord we sang it we sang it excuse me a few weeks ago at uh uh, Bible, uh, Bible story time on Wednesday evening. So let's review it. We sing, I will trust the Lord three times. And on the third time we say in everything, because that's what we should do. And in between, we're going to clap one, two, three times. You ready? Here we go. I will trust the Lord. I will trust the Lord. I will trust the Lord in everything. Okay, if you need to stop the video after this, that's fine. Because today we need a shaker. A shaker can be anything. It can be a half-filled bottle of water with a cap on. Um, or it could be, I, I dried a gourd one year. And when you shake it, it makes a cool sound, doesn't it? Or this is um, a little plastic container that I keep my safety pins in. So you can get a plastic container and have mom or dad or grandma, grandpa, babysitter put rice or beans in it. Don't do that yourself. It'll make a real mess. Trust me. So get something that you can shake, a pencil box, your pencil case for school, um, anything that makes noise when you shake it. So go find something. All right, are you ready? I'm gonna shake my gourd the first time, okay? That sounds a little funny, doesn't it? Shake my gourd. Ready? I will trust the Lord. I will trust the Lord. I will trust the Lord in everything. Did you see what we did on everything? Okay, I'm gonna use my other shaker. Let's do, I will thank the Lord. Ready? I will thank the Lord. I will thank the Lord. I will thank the Lord. I will praise. I will praise the Lord. 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 I will serve the Lord. I will serve the Lord. I will serve the Lord in everything. I guess you got to make sure the lid's securely on, don't you? Silly Miss Amy. Have a great day. Thanks for Wow, singing. that was a great song. Did you sing along with her? Because I did. But let us pray the prayer that Jesus taught us. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial. Deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, forever and ever. Amen. Go in peace. Serve the Lord. Thanks be to God. All right, everybody. Have a great week. I will see you on Sunday at worship. Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, Deuteronomy, Joshua, Judges, Ruth. 
First and second Samuel, first and second Kings, first and second Chronicles.